This can be also used for card visual or any normal visuals. Like here, if I go and add in my report a card visual, such as, for example, what I'll do here, I'll go and add a card visual. And let's say in this card visual, I'm showing total internet sales amount in this. And then I may want this to be here right behind this chart uh, and I'll change the size of these to make it a little bit smaller and also the callout value. Callout value is what you see as the number, category label is what category value or label is what you see as a text. So now you see that this is behind this chart whereas if the order of these elements in the selection pane and I'll go to selection pane again to show it to you. Uh, if the order of these elements, for example, if the card was down under all of these, then you wouldn't see that card. So bringing that on top of um, at least the chart that we are going to show uh, makes the layer working really good. So it's a really simple function to use, the selection pane. Uh, it's a place that you control which visual comes on top of the other visual. You also toggle the visibility, which works really good with bookmarks.